The most important thing about any tool is for it to be repairable and on this pressure washer gun here's how to solve every possible leak. The first possibility of a leak comes from this o-ring which sits inside the quick connector and seals against the nozzle but if it's missing or damaged you'll get a leak like this and that's why there's an extra o-ring included to solve this. The second leak can either come from the threads or the swivel itself. If it's coming from those threads use a wrench to take off the plug and then apply four to five rounds of teflon tape and reinstall everything for a tight seal and the teflon tape is included as well. But if the swivel is leaking, its most likely cause is this allen bolt that's loose. To solve this, you'll need a Phillips head screwdriver to go under the hood. And now we can disassemble the swivel using a 6mm allen key and a wrench. Inspect the o-ring on the allen bolt and replace it if necessary. It's important to scrape off the old thread sealant using a pick and a wire brush. And make sure there's no loose debris left behind which can get stuck inside the valve mechanism. Then I clean the allen bolt and add a dab of silicone on the o-ring. And now I can reassemble the swivel and add a dab of blue thread lock on the end to seal everything. And after letting it cure, the swivel feels perfect and the last leak happens if there's debris stuck in the valve crack open this retaining nut and inside there will be a spring and a ball bearing then pull out the trigger pin and clean all of these parts thoroughly with a microfiber towel and some alcohol to reassemble add a dab of silicone to the trigger pin and push it into place like this then you can drop in the ball bearing and thread on the retaining nut with the spring inside and after tightening this up and reinstalling the plastic body all of your leaks should be fully fixed